when you solve your own problem in your mind, majority problem in your life are already solved. So that's why many of you, I saw when you drew frustration, I know you all have some feeling to Dharma, but that, that feeling becomes, you want to make the feeling to real practice, real practice you want to benefit yourself and benefit other. You really want that. You need to learn about your mind through the Buddha's teaching. You learn about how to transform our mind. So that's why today I'm going to explain about meditation, that what we need for meditation from the Buddha's teaching. <laughs> One thing you, we all should know, Buddha have two powers. One is the Buddha himself power, second is Buddha's teachings power. You mm -hmm. must learn the Dharma to practice, that is the Buddha's power, Buddha's blessing. But second power is, we have fear, you know fear? In Chinese, how you say fear? Kong Chu. Kong Chu. You know Kong Chu? Yeah. Kong Chu. Yeah. What is Kong Chu? Yeah. Yeah. Kong Chu. Fear, fear. You understand? I meditate before. I study. Trust the Buddha, 50%. Kung Chu, 50. Understand? Now I practice, I read. 100% trust. Fear, almost zero. I have fear, but not so much. Not like before. Very much zero. So it's a very important, many of you, you are study people, who people study, study, you know study? Philosophy, study, modern school, asking questions, reading, writing. Okay, no problem, you can ask whatever you want. But you look in your heart, you have fear. So the trust you have to the Buddha, the Buddha's blessing is first your fear goes down. But just enjoy, not good. Sit, meditate. Then the Buddha's blessing, fear go down. Your meditation practice, you get freedom. And this combination is very important. So you need both. You can't just have only one. How do you post? First, trust to the Buddha. Yes. Then your fear go down. Then you meditate, you get freedom. You need this book. Years already here, white color, you <laughs> with a pen. I have trust, but I don't have no time to practice. It's too late, I'm sorry. Oh, me so far. It's too late. I'm not kidding to you. I study, I'm, I'm a person who studies books. You understand? I study books. I study philosophy. I know what I'm talking. Trust very important. I practice every day, wherever I go. I think in the car. Huh? Our master, Guru Padma Sambhava. All the Buddha, all the four, four all the four, uh, pa, son, all mm -hmm. go into the Buddha, uh, our master, Guru Padma Sambhava, our, our master. Then, in the middle, I practice compassion. I, I wish all being happiness, cause of happiness, all sentient being, equal, equal practice. Then meditate in the car. Then I can chant. I, I start here, I start, I don't talk. People talk to me, I don't talk. I hear like this, I go, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't talk. I talk, I go back. You can't just in the halfway, ah, yeah, oh, meda. But you're not chanting the mantra, you're chanting, oh, Masibimana, oh, ni hao ma, oh, Masibimana, ni hao ma, ni hao. It's not good, all mixed together, it's not right. And you understand? So you can't do that. You have mala, you must start, and you must end. So I give you my idea. 
my explanation. When you learn meditation, before I do meditation, huh, I, I, I do like this. That is, you know, good motivation, bodhicitta. Then, I'm a sifu, temple, monk. It's not, not, uh, not pure. You understand? Like you, my family, my work, my house, my car, my things. It's not from the heart. Too many clothes, too many things. Too many. Now I tell you to all you become monk, none is not, not possible. So how to do? Okay. Before you do meditation, few minutes, you think you don't have nothing. I know you feel uncomfortable. Me too, in the beginning. After you try a few times, not difficult. Very good. I don't have nothing. Yeah? Then meditate. Then meditation is very pure. Meditation becomes very pure. Your 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 heart becomes very pure. Now you do meditation now. You meditate. Oh I saw Buddha. Oh my body become. Oh my business get better. <laughs> my wife is happy. Like that, you understand? So meditation never to your heart. Meditation all the time is your house, your family, I don't know, all this. So when you learn meditation, it's very important to detach. Some people say detach is very difficult, means you don't love them. No, 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 it's not meaning you don't love them. Meaning that when you want to learn meditation, you can't have all things holding. You think whole holding is not pure. I don't know how to say it. It's not pure completely. Your heart is not naked. Your heart is too many things like this. You understand? <coughs> Me, my family, my bank account, my house, my face, my family, Tan family, Xing family, Li family. The meditation is not pure. Like me, huh? I'm Sifu, temple, center, foundation, yeah? fundraising. Oh, yeah. No pure. So, Buddha, he said that it's very important to have short moment to say, I don't have nothing. And you don't need to detach. You say, oh, go. No, no, no. I'm not saying that. I, I'm saying, you think that I don't have. Buddha said here in the Samadhi Raja Sutra, example in the offerings, how to be free from three concepts, three, three fears, spheres, how to be free. That means Buddha actually explained. When you free from clinging to Buddha that you offering to, you, you do not see who is offerer, myself. You don't have no existing clinging of myself. And the object of the Buddha is not truly exist. And what you're doing these offerings, you don't have no uh, how you say attachment to the result of your offerings. When you don't have this attachment, these three attachment, that means you have free from uh, your theory from uh, this subject and object and actions. This is what Buddha explained, you, how to be free. Now, these things are, I'm telling you, is the real Dharma practice stuff. Okay, not the normal thing. Normal thing are, you accumulate merit, you pray for your family, pray for yourself. This is a normal thing. It's a mm -hmm. normal stuff for the normal people. Mm -hmm. But you really want to learn a Dharma stuff, the real practice stuff, then this is the thing that you learn. Then makes me a little scared. I do so much work, but I cannot have attachment to my result. It makes you, it makes you feel uncomfortable. You know? so that's, that's why it's very important, I'm telling you, the real Buddha's teaching is a little different. 
So you want to learn the real thing, this is the real thing. What do you ask the question and this is the answer. And I read from the Samadhi Sudra, yeah, to your answer. Okay? Thank you.